Hey guys, welcome back to Spice Fry. So for today's recipe, we are going to be showing you a dish that is hands down one of our personal favorites and we are sure you are going to love it too. So here is presenting roasted red bell pepper hummus. The roasted red bell peppers in this dish give the classic hummus a unique zing of spice and smokiness that is absolutely delicious. So let's see how it's made. The very first step that you have to do the night or at least 6 hours before is soaking 200 grams of chickpeas in water. Once the soaked chickpeas double in size, transfer them to a pressure cooker along with 250 ml of water or enough water so that all the chickpeas are nicely immersed. Add 1 teaspoon of salt to this and then cook it for about 2 whistles. Open the lid of the pressure cooker and check the chickpeas for softness. You should be able to mash them with 2 fingers. If they are not soft enough then cook it some more and give it another whistle. Once the chickpeas are cooked just right, strain them and let them cool down to room temperature but make sure to not throw away the water and save it for later. We'll be using this while preparing our hummus. Next, chop two red bell peppers into four halves and deseed them for roasting. Now, grill or roast the red bell peppers over a flame. You can use a mesh to make this process easier. Make sure to grill it on all sides so that the outer skin becomes charred while the flesh becomes soft. Collect the hot and charred red bell pepper pieces in a ziplock bag and shut it tight. Let it cool down in the bag itself. This process prevents the charred skin from becoming brittle so that it can be scraped off easily. Once the bell peppers have cooled, remove them from the plastic bag and carefully scrape off all the charred skin using a knife. To make the blending process easier, we are now going to roughly slice the de-skin roasted red bell peppers. Transfer the cool down chickpeas to a grinder or a food processor and add the roasted red bell peppers into it. Add 6 to 7 cloves of garlic, 1 teaspoon of salt, half a teaspoon of cumin powder, the juice of 1 lemon. and 1 teaspoon of spice fries homemade tahini sauce. Blend it all using the pulse option on your grinder or switch between on and off. Pour in some of the chickpea water we had kept aside and blend it once again. Now pour in 2-3 to three tablespoons of virgin olive oil and give it another go in the grinder. Check for consistency, it should be smooth and non-grainy. Add more water or olive oil if required.
Once you get the right consistency, your roasted red bell pepper hummus is ready to be served. You can garnish the hummus with sliced olives, paprika, pine nuts and virgin olive oil. Give this hummus variation a try and let us know if you liked it in the comments below. And as always, don't forget to like, subscribe and share and stay tuned for more recipes.